So welcome back. This is another candle review. I'm Jory. Thanks for stopping by. So let's get this candle review going. The first one I have is Goose Creek and it's the Sunday Drive. Right here with the little pretty little flower, little field and little road or something you driving down really pretty and they do have some notes on the front here but I'm gonna read them from the website and it says cactus flower sun oh not sun soft raspberry sparkling lemon jasmine sun kiss coconut and vanilla and it's a soy wax blend This was a nice one, um, the Sunday Drive. It's a nice sweet floral. Um, I had this in the uh, bathroom area, but it floated like into the bedroom. I got like a little, you probably seen in my videos, like a little shelf, and it's like in between the bathroom, and um, it's like that edge where the bathroom is and the bed when you go into the bedroom so it's like by the entrance of those two um rooms coming together nice burn as you can see really good burn on that one this one lasted quite a bit so i didn't i mean it's a nice burn wasn't no suiting issues as you can see the sides are Decent and clean. This was so nice. Like I said, it was a sweet floral. Um, really enjoyed this one. I give it a medium throw. I give it a medium throw. And if you do like numbers, I give it a... I would give it a six. Like, because... But with florals, I don't like them too strong. So this was perfect for me. It was really sweet. Um, good burn. Once again, just showing you the, the burning. It's no issues on that. Um, with this one, I burnt like uh, two hours the mo most of the time or three hours. But most of the time, it was two hours because that's all you need because the fragrance was in the air if you have circulation going on. Um, so, yes, I would definitely repurchase Sunday Drive. Definitely check this one out. I got this one because I saw a review from, they call me Shay, but she had like the, I think they call it like the country jar, like the big one. So... Um, I liked her reviews on it, so I decided to give it a try and definitely check her channel out. They call me Shay. It's, she's pretty funny. She got the little uh, cartoon face or you call it animation. Either one. I'm not, you know, whatever you call it. So, yes, definitely a repurchase on the Sunday Drive. Definitely repurchase of the Sunday Drive. Um... I really enjoyed this. Um, let me see something. Did the note say that? Oh yeah, cactus flower. Um, I think I, I really enjoyed cactus flower. So I got two more candles that have cactus flower or cactus cactus um blossom. So I can't wait to burn those. But this is such an amazing candle. Recommend Sunday Drive from Goose Creek. It's really good. Next. Um, this is the Wild Berry Jam Donut by Bath and Body Works. I like the little packaging with the little donut. I love purple. Um, the burn was decent on this one. Um, so the flames were a little high. Cut it down and then, as you can tell, it wasn't no issue after that. Um, but this one was kind of a disappointment. 
Only because I say that is due to the fact, and this is Wildberry Jam Donut. Um, this one. Oh, let me get the sit notes, then I'll tell you everything. Sweet Wildberry Jam Powdered Donut Brown Sugar Crumble. Um, this one, to me, it didn't smell like a donut. I get the berry note, um, the sweet wild berry jam. I get the berry note of this, but it didn't smell like a donut to me. Um, it was a bakery note or the bakery note wasn't to me a donut. Um, it, it kind of remind me more so of the, um, what's that cereal I used to eat? My aunt used to have like kicks. So in her house, y'all would have like the plain kicks, but then they came out like with the berry one when I was younger. So, um, and I'll show you a picture right here, um, if I could find it, but most like I could find it. It remind me of kicks berry cereal. It, the bakery note of this or um it just smelled like cereal so to me it didn't smell like a donut was this overhyped candle i don't you know y'all let me know was it because i seen a candle haul and this lady this um lady i was watching i was watching her haul and she bought six of these i said oh after i burned this i was like oh maybe hey maybe i don't know my batch was wonky or something did you know didn't get a pretty didn't get a maybe a good batch or something but it just smelled like kid cereal to me which that's why i said mm, i didn't mind continuous burning it because it did mind me of kid cereal but i didn't get a donut i got the the sweetness from the brown sugar crumble it is it was sweet and i got the berry but it just remind me of some kick cereal like a cereal versus a donut smell i don't know that was just me on that so it will not be a repurchase for me um wild berry jam donut uh it was good to experience but it's not a repurchase for me. It was a medium throw to me. Um, and I, if you do numbers, I give it a, I give it a seven. Cause you did smell it, but to me, I wasn't smelling a, you know, a berry filled donut. So, hey, chalk it up. I enjoyed it why I had it. Like I said, it reminded me of a childhood cereal. And that's that. Next, this was mm, my uh, surprisingly favorite uh, morning candle. I burned this one like in the morning time. And it's from Bath and Body Works. They're from their aromatherapy line and it's the orange and ginger candle this one is amazing um let me get to the notes and then i go into my experience so the notes are they got these things so tiny on here i'm already wearing glasses so the notes are ginger orange Experiment, jasmine petals, blonde woods with natural essential oils. Um, this is amazing. Amazing. This was so amazing. Um, it was so bright. You smell the ginger. You smell the orange. It just was very refreshing, bright, kind of you know woke you up energize you when i i mean when i burned this in the morning i would just you know i as soon as i get up i put it on and as it burning i'm smelling it i'm just ready for 
you know, my day to begin, start what I need to do. It motivated me to go ahead and get things I needed to get done. It was such a refreshing, energetic candle to me. It just brightened up the vibes in the house, the mood in the house. It sounded kind of resetted the house. Um, and hey, I didn't think this is the candle that I thought this is the count that I had that I didn't think I needed. Let me put it like that. So definitely pick you up one of these. Um, if they have a good sale on this doing SAS, because I don't really hear a lot of people talking about Bath and Body Works aromatherapy candles. Because um, I don't think they offer too many. Um, as far as the eucalyptus with patchouli one, and I think this one, I don't think they have too many um, offered. So that might be the reason. But this one is amazing. This is my favorite. And I only saw like a old review like years, years ago. Um, an old one, maybe like three or four years, three to five years ago that somebody had. Hmm. <sighs> hmm. That's my review, but this one is so amazing. I love drinking like fresh, fresh, um, fresh pressed ginger. I juice ginger, so I love that smell. I love the taste of it to you know get you know immune system boost and everything. Um, but this is such a good candle for the morning. It just had me feeling, you know. Just energetic, ready, happy, sunshine in the box, y'all. This is amazing, and it's a it's a high thrower, a high thrower. Like it doesn't take long for it to fill a large space or open concept, and just travels, and it just it just gets you in a good mood, good vibes. That's what it gives me. And hopefully, I can snag some of these at, on SAS if I can. Definitely um, try the orange, uh, orange plus ginger candle. This is amazing. This is like one of the best candles I've burned thus far. I think this hit it to the top. And I wouldn't mind again. Having this backed up, I would definitely back this one up. Um, I don't think it get a lot of uh, love, but hey, this was such a good candle for resetting the house. Just good vibes candles, candle. Um, like I said, it's a high thrower. I give it a 10. And I just um, burned this like either two hours or when it like fully pulled. And, the, um, and then put it out because it's so strong. You don't need to burn it uh, any longer than two hours. At least, like, the min maximum two hours. Because once I saw it pooling and I could smell it, I put it out because I was trying to savor it. And plus, it just fills the rooms and it travels. So you don't have to burn it um, a long time. But let me get off my soapbox. But I love this. Um, mm, it's just such an amazing candle and I wish I had got two but hopefully I can get more and back this one up because I love it when I just need to reset my energy and my vibe you know so yeah great candle so that is all for my candle review so let me know if you tried some of these so hey I see you at the next one